Here I want to show changing the orientation of a sketch and extrude. This, one, this particular part has a sketch and extrude. It's extruding down the y-axis, but I want to change it to extrude down the x-axis. So in my part navigator, I want to find the extrude, then edit the sketch. So it brings just the sketch up. I see that it's fully constrained. I'm going to go to reattach. And from here, it allows me to pick a new plane. But I'll get a, a message saying that the horizontal reference is the same as the plane, which makes sense because it, it was. And I'll change the horizontal reference to a new point. Specify point, I don't need to do to uh, uh, modify because it's still going to use the CSIS of my sketch. And I finish that, finish that, and now my part is extruded down X. To take this a little bit further, I've got a, a sketch extrude here. All I'm going to do is right click on it and copy. I want to paste it on the back side. So I go down here, menu, edit, and there's paste. And paste brings up a, a mapping window down here in the lower right hand corner. I'll bring this a little bit larger so I can see what it is. And I have it set to select select parents and then uh, expressions mapping I want it to create new. So it will ask me to pick a face. And similarly I want to pick the edges so that they all the arrows line up the same way. I say OK. And then my sketch, is, it, my sketch extrude has been copied over. So if I come back here to edit sketch, I can see how it was put together. I have my, my associated points down here in the corner. So I have copied this, and I want to change parts to a new, a completely different part, and then just Control V this time. And again, I get my mapping window. It asks for a face. I pick the face. I pick the edge. I'm going to pick the edge here, and I see that my my arrow is pointed in a different direction than what it's showing over here in my original features window. So I'm just going to flip that over to the other side and say OK. And I very quickly copied that sketch extrude from one part to another within the same part and change the orientation of uh, a piece of geometry that I want it to be oriented in a different way.